Christopher and Robin began by logging in with the username and password that their teacher gave them. Then, they clicked on the My Vital Signs link on the top of the page. They found their recent trip under Finish Entering Your Data and Publish. They clicked Edit slash Finish. They uploaded the photo that they took of the study site. They selected the correct habitat that they were studying in. Then, they entered the correct latitude and longitude from the trip. This is key for scientists to know where the data is coming from. Christopher and Robin typed up their field notes. They did not make a field sketch, but that is okay because the field notes and sketches section is optional. They could either add a new species or edit one that was entered earlier. Then, they selected their sampling method, and they uploaded a photo of their sampling method. They scrolled down to select the species they were looking for. They could find it by either selecting common name or scientific name. Time to say if they found the species they were looking for. Now Christopher and Robin added three pieces of evidence to support their found or not found decision. They included both photos and text to support their decision. Time to review all of their entered data. They better check that the map is pointing to the right location. If not, they need to go and fix their latitude and longitude. It is key that scientists know where you are looking. Whoa! Christopher and Robin went through the review and publish page really fast. It is important that they spend their time checking over the data. The peer review section is key to the quality of your data. Have two people check your work. One should check for quality, and the other should give a peer review. Enter the vital signs usernames of your reviewers. 